London has been at the centre of Britain's social and political life for over three centuries. This present house was built in 1851 and it is the third to have been constructed on this site. Queen Victoria herself came here often, describing the house as a perfection of a place. Very occasionally, and if you're very lucky, someone special walks into your life. And this person touches not only your heart, but also your soul, and makes your world a richer place in which to live. And you may find that you want to spend the rest of your lives together. And Natasha and Piers are two of these fortunate people. And this is why we're all here today. I don't know where the time has gone. It only seemed like yesterday when I was cuddling you in my arms and rocking you to sleep. And then whoosh, here we are today. Natasha, you look absolutely beautiful. And your mum and I are so proud of you. In Natasha, <laughs> you will never find someone more loyal, more loving, more thoughtful, more generous, and more cutting and sarcastic. <laughs> And most importantly, as hugely funny as Natasha. Very proud to be Piers' dad. He's been a wonderful son and a, a nice guy. And he's the one of the nicest, most straightforward and reliable people I know. It's very good. And I, we've also been working very closely together for the last uh, five or almost six years now. And I'm extremely proud of what he's achieved in building a brand in the beauty business, which is very competitive, to be now an international brand. You've done a great job, and I'm really proud of you. this woman to be married to this man? I do. <laughs> We're just checking. Yeah. <laughs> I call upon these persons here present to witness that I, Piers, 
Dainsbury Raper. To witness that I, Piers Dainsbury Raper. Do take thee. Do take thee. Natasha Louise Smith. Natasha Louise Smith. To be my lawful wedded wife. To be my lawful wedded wife. I call upon these persons here present. To witness that I, Natasha Louise Smith. To witness that I, Natasha Louise Smith. Do take thee. Do take thee. Piers Dainsbury Raper. Piers Dainsbury Raper. To be my lawful wedded husband. To be my lawful wedded husband. I promise to care for you, to remain true to you, and above all, to love and respect you always. I look forward to sharing my life with you, and as we journey through marriage together, I promise to cherish, love, and care for you always. I promise to support you with love and friendship. I will be your partner and friend for life. I promise to care for you, to remain true to you, and above all, to love and respect you always. I look forward to sharing my life with you, and as we journey through marriage together, I promise to cherish, love, and care for you always. I promise to support you with love and friendship. I will be your partner and best friend for life. Natasha, I give you this ring. As a sign of my love. As a sign of my love. And as a symbol of our marriage. And as a symbol of our marriage. Piers, I give you this ring. As a sign of my love. As a sign of my love. And as a symbol of our marriage. And as a symbol of our marriage. From today, Saturday, October the 27th, 2018, you are lawfully joined in matrimony and are husband and wife together. And I'd like to be the very first to congratulate you and wish you every happiness together. And Piers, I'm sure your guests won't mind if you give your beautiful bride a kiss to seal the occasion. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Mr. and Mrs. Raper. Natasha, you are the most special, wonderful person in my life. You look absolutely beautiful. Literally nothing could have prepared me for you walking down the aisle today. It was absolutely unbelievable. Thank you for marrying me and making me the proudest man in the world. I've had the best five years of my life with you and I can't wait to spend um, the rest of it with you by my side. I love you very, very much. It was my brother's birthday. We've been out for dinner in Richmond. I went and met him in Ubawan 
and we had an amazing night. Didn't want it to end. Just the sparks were flying, butterflies, heart beating so fast, everything. Everything that it should be like. Every day after work, I would go to his. It was just incredible. He just was the one. I knew he was the one. He's my best friend. There is nothing I wouldn't do for him, and I know there's nothing he wouldn't do for me. He is the most incredible man in the whole world. He's unique. There's no one like him. Thank you.